Hey guys, this is Nikki26. I am about to do a Sigma tutorial slash review. Okay, to start the tutorial, I usually start doing my makeup. I start my brows first. And yes to the person who said I have half moon brows. I love them just like that. <laughs> and then I'm using Conceal Eye Base from Bitch Lab Cosmetics. And I'm going to put that on my lid. I'm using my Sigma 252 brush. And I'm using the Start Me Up eyeshadow to start me up. I do love the Sigma brushes and um, I'm patting that right there on my lower lid. I'm taking my e.l.f. contouring brush and I am dipping it into the painted black. Now this color is beautiful. I love this color. And I'm putting that right on the outer V of my eye. And you can use just like, you know, little circular motions. I'm using the Shine a Light eyeshadow on my highlight. And this color I didn't like so much because it was very loose. And I took my uh, MAC 266 angle brush and I dipped that into painted black and I used that as my liner. And I'm using a Q-tip to clean up and I'm taking my classic Maybelline um, eye pencil and I'm putting that on my waterline. And back to my MAC 226 uh, angle brush and I'm using that to line my waterline. And I'm taking my finger because that's the way I like to put apply my concealer. And now I'm on foundation. Wow, that was fast. So I'm applying my foundation. And I'm using the Sigma SS182 Kabuki brush. And I'm dipping that into my blotting powder from Bitch Lab Cosmetics. And I'm swirling it all over my face. Buff, buff, buff. And I'm adding some lashes. Have to add the dramatics, darling. And I'm trying Sigma's blush for the first time. And that blush is some girl. And I really do like that blush. It's a nice shimmer blush. Um... I, and I'm also applying the highlight and the highlight is called Moonlit Mile, Moonlight Mile. And as you can see, it's very iridescent. The color is really pretty and gives a nice glow. And I am wearing a lipstick from NYX and bare lip gloss from Bitch Slap Cosmetics. I hope you guys like the way I do my tutorials. And this is the day that I found out the baby was born. So we rushed off to the hospital with my um, makeup on. And I just want to go into the Sigma review a little bit here. I wanted to try the makeup and I do like the makeup. There's some things that I don't like. I use the SS187 to apply my foundation. And the only thing that I don't like about that brush is that it does shed a lot. But um, this is the brush that I use in every single video. That is the brush that I use to um, apply my foundation on. I like the highlight kit. Um, I love Moonlit Mile and that's um, the golden color. I do like some girls. It's a peachy color and Ruby Tuesday. Those are the colors that I like. I am not a fan of the fadeaway. The fadeaway is a matte shat a matte um blush and I don't like matte blushes on my skin. Um, I used the smoky eye kit for this tutorial and I loved every single color in the smoky eye kit except for Shine a Light. Shine a Light was very loose. Um, and it had a lot of fallout. The color did stay on. It just um, had a lot of fallout. Now, um, it had staying power because I did go to the hospital with this look. Um, the makeup stayed stayed in place. And um, I have a mirror, the rhinestone mirror that I have been eyeing for the longest time. With Ever since I um, got my brushes from Sigma. And I'm like, I love this mirror. Um, I love boxes so much, I kept them. So, um, I just thought the boxes that the makeup came in was so cute. So, I definitely have all of them. Um, also, a thing that I think that would be beneficial is that each and every eyeshadow or highlight powder, color, blush, um, they all came in an individual compact. And I think that there should have been some way to recycle these, like maybe send those back to Sigma, like how um, MAC has the Back to MAC program. I want to say thank you again to Simone and Catherine at Sigma. You guys are wonderful, and thank you for being with me. And um, you guys should check Sigma out at SigmaMakeup.com. And I'm um, Sneak26, and I'm out of here. Mwah.